Thank you for having me. My name is Philip Grunvold. I am a product manager at Opera Software. We're here at IDF 2011 showcasing Opera Mobile 11.1 on Android x86. We're actually here at the uh, Intel booth uh, on the technology exhibit hall. Uh, we're very excited to be able to showcase, uh, I think for the first time, uh, NDK application running on the x86 architecture. And this is Opera Mobile. Excellent. Let's get into a demo then. Of course. Here you see the Intel uh, form factor device. Uh, this is the Greenridge device. And we'll go ahead and load Opera Mobile here. Here you see the start page that you're familiar with with Opera Mobile, but we'll go right into loading a few websites for you to see that performance. We're going to bring up a heavy website. Uh, this is one of our testing websites uh, to showcase exactly how quick and how fast Opera is at loading a web page that's very heavy with images. So even while this page is loading, you have smooth zooming, or smooth scrolling here. We can go a little bit quicker too if needed. And zooming in. So did you guys have to deal with any of the TraceJit um, optimizations that they've just recently launched to improve performance on x86? Uh, we, Android we, x86, or you don't deal with that, that layer? We don't deal with that layer, but we've actually been very happy uh, in the last... It's, it's been about now 15 weeks. We've been very happy to see um, the improvements here on the x86 versions, and we have benefited with that performance here in the Opera Mobile product. So there's a great example of a, of a web page loading, and we'll do uh, one more demo here for you, just to show some standard support. We're going to load up the good old HTML5test.com. I also noticed uh, during the keynote that Opera was on the Medfield tablet. That's right. We're being showcased in the uh, Atom booth here at the IDF as well on the Medfield tablet. They don't have that one out to actually be demoed or touched, uh, but we are uh, showcased there. And you can see the demo if you would like to if you go over to the Atom booth there. And uh, the Medfield... Uh, Build actually has a new graphics accelerator uh, within it. Do you, do you access that? Not currently. This uh, Opera Mobile here on the Green Ridge device, even though it is really super smooth, is actually only using CPU acceleration. We are not using our graphics acceleration backends yet. We look forward to working with Intel to bring OpenGL acceleration to this uh, Opera browser to even improve the performance even further. And that will also be on the Medfield devices. Have you noticed a difference in performance because they've doubled the memory bandwidth on Medfield? Since we're not using the uh, graphics yet, um, it's, it's not really a benefit for us so much, but the, we do see the difference in performance when it comes to uh, the operating system and the device itself. Really excited to see what uh, the new graphics in Medfield is going to be able to deliver for us in the browser as well. Awesome. Well, always excited to see uh, new applications running on Android, especially with Intel's whole uh, port of choice thing going on. <laughs> This is the uh, yeah. This has been uh, the X86 NDK uh, from Intel. We're very excited about this uh, to be able to showcase this here at IDF 2011. Thank you very much. Thank you for your time.